Hello, and welcome to Killer Castro Does Horror RPG Let's Play. Okay, guys, so this is a game called Close Your Eyes. It is under the horror category in Steam, so if you want to go and download it, download it from the Steam store, okay, guys? It is a free to play game, it's just one I wanted to start off nicely with. Um, I've never played it before. So this is a first for me as much as it is for you. So let's check it out and see how good we think it is, guys. <laughs> I finally find the buttons. Sorry. Okay, before playing, the options menu on the little screen lets you adjust resolution and audio settings. As you can see, S12 will reset the game at any time. Default on the keyboard controls are arrow keys to move, enter and space and Z to interact, escape X and numpad zero to cancel. Default the controller, blah blah blah. Yeah, let's just get into it. As a horror game, don't rob yourself that experience. The game is best enjoyed in a dark environment wearing headphones. Two seconds, I will put my headphones on. Okay, guys. Oh, oh, wait. Okay, close my eyes. Okay, so what are we doing here? Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. How are you all doing? Today, our exciting detective is Death Defying. Death Wrong Defying, that is. <laughs> oh, that's a nice introduction straight there. He's a little. Okay, let's just, let's, let's, uh, yeah. <laughs> Alright, so, so straight off we've got, ready, last words, um, 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 uh, <laughs> yeah, I, okay, so, straight off we're kind of thrown into this game, um, it's kind of, wow. What? Sick. Well, that, that's pretty lucky. Um, we we just got lucky there, I think. <laughs> Let's get away. Let's run. <laughs> um, I think I think this is us. Yeah, yeah, this is us. Oh. Okay. Let's 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 take a run. So it seems to be like a little scroll game. I mean. Nothing too complicated, I guess. Um, sorry if you're expecting more. Um, but yeah, let's. What? What's going on now? Oh, I got away. Okay, let's have a look. What's What's this? Uh, <coughs> let's just file save under one. Um, I'm guessing we're going this way. Uh, it seems to be like a little puzzle game. Avoid. Well, everything really. Oh. Okay, so I just completely disappeared. Oh, look at me! <laughs> okay, so yeah, this uh, seems to be fairly interesting. Let's have a look at what's in here. Um, hidden hang heals the heals the key. Okay, so uh, so yeah, I have no idea like what I'm supposed to be doing on this game so if any of you have actually played this game and have any form of clue then guys please leave a comment let me know um oh oh I got a red labeled cassette Sounds a bit strange. Okay, so... Okay, so... 
you get wrong, you'll be the one who I I I don't know. Uh, um, yeah. Yeah, so, yeah, that, that song's kind of creeping me out, let, let's be fair. Um, okay, so, um, apparently I found another cassette. Let's, let's, let's go this way, apparently, so, from what I can gather, guys, um, where a robber um, and uh, yeah so we're, we're, we've got some puzzles to have a little look at um, keep finding these cassettes which are well really strange actually Another place there was an old house. Or so they say she cursed anyone who dared on her lonely space. Okay, so that's um uh, just the slightest bit creaky. What door's now open? Okay. Um uh, yeah. I mean, I don't know who invented this game, who came up with this game. Uh, it's, let, let's be fair, it's it's um, not a uh, fantastical graphics or anything like that. It's peek -a uh, <laughs> Yeah, it doesn't seem to be all that scary either. Um, I'm wondering how long it will actually take to complete this game. Because um, obviously I'm doing a uh, Let's Play. We'll, we'll uh, <coughs> have a look and see how long it takes me. Um, I'm hoping not very long, because um, then I'll find another game, uh, maybe Five Nights at Freddy, or something like that, because I've heard that that is an immensely terrifying game. Um, maybe, I, I mean, I'm not holding out Prospect, I think that this game could actually possibly hold some secrets. Um, you never know, you never know, maybe we'll get a bit more scared along the way. They, they are a bit creepy, these uh, little cassettes and stuff. So, yeah. Scratching at your fears, let the tears flow. Lost in an empty shell, only known as hatred. Well, that, that sounds fun. Um, thanks for that. Let's check this door. Oh, what? Really? Okay, so the door is not open. Uh, yeah, why not? Turn on the power generator. The power is now on. Okay. Um... So let's go back down this way then. Uh, I swear I just heard a door or something. Oh, of course the door's open. Whoa. Okay, so whoa, whoa, whoa. What's this? Turnstile ticket. Okay. Um. Uh, I kind of like the, the, the I don't know, the, the feel of this game is kind of interesting. Um, the, the fact that you have your little character who's kind of, well, creepy looking himself. He's like a, a, a miniature Grim Reaper of sorts, isn't he? Just like a convict Grim Reaper. It's, uh, yeah. Guys, do you, do you hear that noise? I'm wondering what that is. Any ideas, guys? If you've got ideas, let me know in the comments below, guys. Maybe we'll find out in this episode. Maybe we won't. Let's try and find out what the heck is going on in this game. Um, it's slightly confusing. I... Uh, come again? Um... Okay, so so that sign changed, guys. That that sign definitely changed. All right. Um, apparently, someone saw me. I'm kind of confused. Hey, there we go. 
There we go. Okay, so yeah. Uh, <coughs> as I say, I've never played this game before. It 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 seems very common sensey, very straightforward. Um, let's uh, save over that and yeah. Um, okay, so. Uh, okay, why am I like? It's just spooky. It's kind of a bit dark. Um, yeah, I've got no idea what's going on. Whoa! Did you see that, guys? Did you see that? I will zoom in on that, guys. There, there was a... Oh, getting a bit chills and spooky now. There was like a ghost figure of a woman or something. Oh, there she is again. Look, 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 look. Right there. Right, right up the top. Right here. Here you go. Where my mouse is right now. Um, she she seems a bit creepy, if I'm honest. Um, I'm not sure. This isn't right. Where do you suppose we're headed? The subway system isn't in use, and so what are you hiding? Did when? Um, yeah, kind of, she's kind of creepy. <laughs> okay, so, yeah, the woman is kind of like, going, did you do something wrong? Are you hiding? She's kind of like saying, why are you hiding in a subway or going to a subway that's out of use? Um, kind of interesting, I guess. Um, I don't think, oh, oh, oh god, I saw something. Oh god. Um, hopefully we don't run into whatever the hell that was. Uh, yeah. Right. Okay, so let's have a look. It's too dark. Okay. Um, uh, okay. Hey! Look at that! An eye is staring back at me. Oh god. A poster of an eye. Oh. Whew, that's okay. Alright, we're okay. We're okay. Um, yeah. So, yeah, I don't know how much longer I'll place this episode on for, guys. Um, sorry if it hasn't been all that thrilling or entertaining. I, I kind of had a bit of higher hopes for this game. But I wanted to try something a bit more retro-looking. Um, and a bit horror-y at the same time. So it's, it's got that creepy sort of element to it. Um, I'm not... No, I don't think I'm that great at being scared. <laughs> Let's be fair, um, but you know we'll we'll have a look and we'll carry on. And what the hell is that? What is that? What is that? Um, um, that's a corpse. Uh, why 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 is that? Oh my God, it's headless. Um, uh, uh that that's that's not creepy. Nope, not at all. Not creepy at all. A note plastered here. It seems to be related to the train system and the station. The train runs in a straight line. There are four stations and a different colour door opens at each of the stations. The station furthest east opens the blue door. The station furthest... What? Hang on. Sorry. Really bad narration here. The station furthest east opens the blue door the station first station to the east opens the red door the first station to the west opens the yellow door the furthest station to the west opens the green door the train's route is the same every day it always begins and ends its route at this station it then heads to the station furthest east, the only time in the day it goes that far eastward. And then heads all the way west, making stop at each station along the way. The train then heads back east, one by one, and then goes backwards the way it came, to the west by one. It then ends the route and comes out the rest of, comes to the rest for the night. Okay. The route it takes also doubles as the release for the security lock. Right, okay, so it doubles up as a release for a security lock. 
Uh, that's the dead body we found a minute ago. Is that a hole? Oh, metal wire gate, it seems to descend further into the subway system. Um, okay, so... Can we go that way? No, apparently not. So let's, 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 let's just kind of head this way. Um, I'll give credit to whoever did invent this. I mean, like, it must be, um, I would hesitate to say maybe a new game designer. Um, the, the, after having done a little bit of game design myself, I kind of see how it would be an easy one to start off with, to open up with. Um, uh, okay, so if I remember rightly, it was green, blue, red, yellow, yellow, red, green, blue. Nope. Enter the passcode. Seems to want you to enter in some eight digit button. Hmm. Blue, green, red, yellow. Yellow, red, green, blue. Nope, not a clue. Right. Okay, so I'm guessing we have to find the passcode to that, but maybe it was in the clue. I might have to read that poster again, um, but we will see, I think. Um, okay. Okay, well, guys, um, what I'll do is I'll leave it here. We're at the train station. Um, I'll try and figure out what the combination to the color code is. Um, if you guys know what the combination is then let me know oh we've got garbage can. <laughs> okay uh yeah if you can figure out what the the uh, combination to this little lock bit is here please let me know in the comments guys and uh, we can sort it out for the next episode if you've played this game before please um hit up in the comments let me know if it gets any scarier if it doesn't then I don't know we'll still play it through all the way um, we'll see how this game ends and then we'll move on to something else I think um, but for now guys I will say thanks for watching and have a good one guys don't forget hit up like and subscribe